and hello comic book fans it is Friday night I am continuing with my new format sorry about the light in the background it is the 21st of June the longest day of the year so the sun is pretty much coming right in through my balcony um, so it's kind of weird I'd have to wait until midnight one o'clock in the morning to do the res these reviews before the sun is out of the thing so I'm gonna have to deal with it so my new review pattern now is to do the two favorite comics for the week and then the one that I'm most disappointed with and do them separately and uh, let me uh, tell you what I think afterwards Talk to you later. And now for the last of the night. Last review of the night. <coughs> Excuse me. The best comic I read this week. I have to tell you, I'm. it was so awesome. Would be deceased. This is number five. I got the Joker cover. I don't know if I have it in my thing, but it's this one right here. <laughs> California Joker. Damn. Damn. Did I mention damn? Okay, so if you haven't read it, been reading this, little spoiler alert. It, last issue ends with Captain Adam trying to do something and there's, uh, Superman and Wonder Woman going up around him and he explodes and I guess it takes out half the eastern seaboard with uh, Superman and Wonder Woman very close by so you're, you're wondering if they survive well this issue picks up from there and it's hard to believe that it could get much more uh, suspenseful but when I was out at breakfast with Comic Book Joe uh, Wednesday, he said that Taylor, the, the artist, was like, this is the hardest issue he had ever had to read, I mean, to write. And uh, to read it quickly, because spoilers were out there. And so I knew something was going to happen. Something had to happen. So I stayed away from the internet, and uh, it was the last book that I read. Just because I knew it was going to be good. I always save the best, what I think is going to be the best for last. And it did not disappoint. Man. Some people will take that as a punch in the gut. Me, not so much. But it was... It was, it was, damn. Uh, things are not going well. Things are not going well at all. And I have the feeling by the end of number six, there's not going to be, be anybody left. Uh, this is getting good. The, the art is fantastic. The story is incredible. It moves at a good pace. It makes sense. Uh, damn, this is some, this is some this is some good storytelling, some visual and uh, visual and written. And someone has to say goodbye to their family. And I have to tell you, I was at work when I was reading it, and there was some. Uh, if I'd been at home, I would have let the worst, you know, would let it come. But I had to try and uh, hold it off. It was rough. So, if you haven't been picking this up, go back and get the issue, the previous issues, and uh, read it, because it's damn 
damn good. Some fine storytelling. I'm going to give this 4 out of 5. 4.5 out of 5. And suggest you pick it up. Because you'll regret it if you don't.